Hey, my beauties. Missy Prissy Border here. Welcome to my channel. Tonight, we're going to have a haul video. Um, this is a haul from TJ Maxx, Gabe's, and I got a couple of random things from like Kroger and Target. Um, so, I just thought we would have a haul. I love to watch haul videos myself, so I thought we'd just do that. Now, um, my TJ Maxx finds are over the course of like three trips, th three different trips. Um, because sometimes when I have a haul, I might not have brought it all in or, or whatever it, the case may be, you know. Or I might have just picked up, um, a couple things here and there. And so, then I actually saved them from a haul. If you happen to notice my neck, just know that it is self-tanner gone bad. Actually, it is self-tanner, but you know how it is when it starts to fade and you haven't really taken the time to put on more, so... That's what that is, and just in case anyone's wondering, um, tonight I just wanted to get out of the house. I really didn't want Kroger to take my whole Saturday night. I mean, it don't matter, you know, but it is what it is. Um, but you know, I just thought, I need a little lipstick. I don't really need lipstick, but sometimes if you're just feeling not 100% and today or tonight, I felt like I was only feeling like 75 and 80%, not necessarily down the dumps, but kind of, it felt like you're headed that way or not really, it's kind of hard to explain, but I wasn't feeling 100% is what I'm trying to get at. So I thought, what better time to go get a new lipstick because that always makes me feel better. So... I did. I went to TJ Maxx, um, ran into um, a girl I went to school with, so we planned to have lunch one day, and um, so that was fun, and um, you know, you just get out and talk to people, whether it's random people or, you know, it's just, I don't really meet a stranger too much, I mean, I can just talk to anybody, you know, like I've known you all my life, because that's pretty much just the way I am, you know, um, I did see something tonight, though, that really made me ill. It really did. And I I, I wish I had told someone. Um, because I guess if I'd been more in the... More of... Um, I don't know. It just made me really ill. I wish I had told someone. But this lady, she, um, was, she was with this other girl, a lady, and she was sitting on the aisle and... Um, she, this lady had, it's almost like she was with her friend, and her friend said, here, this is the lipstick I was telling you about. Um, and I just chimed in and said, yeah, this is the best stuff, blah, 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 you know. And, um, and it's actually one of the lipsticks that I have bought several of. Um, it's the, um, Paracon MD or whatever, you know, I, um, Anyway, the one that is like a no makeup makeup. I, actually, I'll show you what it is. It's one of my favorite lipsticks in this tube right here. That that's one of my favorite lipsticks. Well, anyways, so um, that lady took it out now and she swatched it on her hand and put it back in the tube and put it back on the shelf. That made me so ill. And when I was, I was thinking. You know, it's people like you that, you know, <laughs> I mean, she shouldn't have done that. I'm just going to hope and pray she actually took that lipstick home with her because she should have known better, you know? I mean, that just kind of ruins it for other people. Um, and she, you know, I just, I couldn't believe what I saw. I'm just saying, I wish I had told someone. Um, because that really, after I have got home and thought about it some more, it really bothered me, but I can't do nothing about it now, so... But personally, when I'm buying a lipstick like that um, somewhere, I do open it and I look around like the side of it to make sure that nobody has touched it. Because you can tell, you know, if they've got some fingerprints in something or because um, it just makes a little print, you know. So I always just try to look at the stuff that I buy really well um, to make sure that somebody hadn't swatched it on their hand or or whatever that just ruins it why would she do that you know i mean if you're not gonna buy it I, I certainly wouldn't touch it anyways i'll get off on that i'll just get away from that um 
but the day that I, I, I didn't have this over here the day that I showed you the, um, when I did the Jason Wu Target pencils that I had ordered. I had also ordered this little perfume, and it's just, it's called Vanilla. And if you like to smell vanilla, oh my stars. I spray my bed with it. I spray my clothes with it. I spray everything with it because I love to smell vanilla. I, in fact, I had already put on some, but hey, let's just put on some more, you know. It's vanilla. It smells like cake. I mean, well, vanilla reminds me of cake because that's what you put in to make cake, you know. Um, so, yeah, I just, I got that at Target. Um, it came in my, my, uh, order when I ordered the lipstick pencil so I just wanted to share that with you if you like vanilla I can't remember how much it was maybe I, I just I don't even want to say how much it was because I can't remember how much it was but I bought it at target.com so anyways if you like vanilla get you some because it is the best it smells so good how do you like these janky nails I mean, I did paint this hand, but then I for, I picked it this one day because I forgot that I had it on there, and I didn't get to that, so whatever. Let's just get in the haul. You want to? I'm sure y'all rather have the haul than talk about the nails. <coughs> I got these at Kroger, actually, because I'm going to try them. I had never tried that down. So I got a birthday party to go to, and I like, you know, when I'm giving kids a gift, I usually try to throw in some Hot Wheels if they're of age. So I got this Hot Wheel. And I'm doing a birthday gift. And I got this cute little Hot Wheel. Look at that. I got these at Kroger. Oh boy. Um, another thing I got at Kroger was this color tattoo from Maybelline. Um, I have tried something like this from before. This color is um, tween is um, tweeny and it's socialite. And... It's just like an all-over um, eye cream, and uh, I'm going to show it to y'all. I've had something like this before, uh, but it was Mary Kay. I can't remember what it was, but if you, I do know if you don't leave the lid on good, they'll dry out. Um, it's just like a little it's a cream eyeshadow, and these stuff, they will stay on all day long. I mean, you can put it on, you can wear it by itself. Or you can just barely there, which is what I wanted because I just wanted a light color. Um, you can wear it by itself or you can layer it, you know. But I love these things. They had more colors, but I just wanted a, a real light shimmer. So in case I just see that's the color too, you can wipe it off. I just wanted like a, um, a light color that I could just wear all over my eyes. So I mentioned the birthday party. So this is my little outfit right here. This was $6.99 compared to $46.50. Um, so it was $6.99. I thought it was so cute. Look at that. And I love little rompers, you know, for little boys and little girls too, actually. But this is super cute. I got some motion, but y'all probably don't want to see that. Oh, and these right here, these wipes, it's kind of like to wipe my face, my hands when I'm doing my makeup, whatever. Got two packs of these at Kroger. I do know these are a dollar pack, and they are the best kind of baby wipes ever. So there's that. Um, I got my son a huge beach towel. It was $12.99. Got it at TJ Maxx. It's a hill figure, and I just love this turquoise blue with the navy and the red. It was just super cute. So I got that for Richard. And for myself, because you know I need one to eat. I mean, I probably don't, but I probably am. Um, got me in two packs of wipes, actually. But my blanket is just it, blanket. It's not a blanket, it's a towel. It caught my eye. It just It's a um, ombre. And it went from like orange to pink, purple, another purple, blue, turquoise, let's see, green. It's just so pretty. It's just ombre. And then the, if I unfold it, you get these colors right here. 
But this was also $12.99, I think. $12.99 compared to... Let's see if that compares to something. I love these huge beach towels. No, it don't compare. It don't say on this one right here. No, I don't know what it compares to. My bad. There's nothing it compares to, I guess, because I can't see it. Okay, so um, last week when I had left this in the car, I had bought this before at TJ Maxx, five ninety nine. Hashtag mom life. I am a mom. Love this cup. It's pink. I love the pink. And I got one that says just breathe. Also five ninety nine. I love Raydon. I can't get enough of Raydon. Um, I do have some Raydon stuff tonight that I absolutely love. Just can't get enough of Raydon. I'm about to run out of room here. I hope y'all don't fall. I've been seeing this cup forever, and I absolutely love this color of blue. Boss Mom. I love this. This was actually $9.99, I guess, because it's wearing a crown. Um, I'm wondering, is the crown made for um, your pennies? <laughs> or, your, I mean, your, your loose change? Um, or your crackers while you're drinking your coffee or tea? I don't know, but it's super cute, though, and I just absolutely love it. I've been looking at one like this for a while now, so it just says Boss Mom. I, I just love it. I love the color that it is. I did take some pictures tonight while I was at TJ Maxx. They had the cutest, um, like, cookie jar or something. It said Bless Mom, and it was that beautiful color blue. Oh, my gosh, I loved it. But I left it on my shelf. I can't have everything. Oh, and this is a candle that was on the clearance rack it's super large and it was eight dollars and it says it is magnolia blossoms but it reminded me of the beach <sighs> it smells just like sunscreen and i love to smell that smell so anyways i thought that was pretty and it's pink i like pink tired tonight y'all my body just feels like it it's so stiff and I, I don't know why it's so stiff I've been feeling that for a couple of days now I actually got this one for my mama and it says live with purpose I thought that was pretty and this was $5.99 okay we got one more bag and then we got a couple things from uh Like, oh, a couple of things from Gabe. Gabe's. I didn't know there was a store called Gabe's, but actually it is a um, store that has multiple locations. And um, it's like a discount store. It's kind of like um, Ross, but bigger. Or Ross on steroids, or maybe like TJ Maxx on steroids. You know, you get, you get the point, though. Um, I'm going to paint my bathroom cabinets. Um, I had some knobs already that I were going to use that I've been saving for a long time. But they were that, they had pewter on the knobs instead of um, silver. And these were $10. Um, so I got these beauties right here. I'm going to paint my bathroom cabinets and then and put clean, uh, clean, new knobs on there. So I just love these because they, they're just girly and glam and I just love them so I got two packs of these I'm running out of room y'all really running out of room here I got some well let me just get this stuff out and then we'll talk about it how about that This is the beauty bag, pretty much. This is 
is the beauty bag. Except for these. Let me show you this right here. It's more right done though. Y'all know, well, y'all probably don't know, but my friends do know. I do love a good bowl of cereal. So these say, good morning, good morning. I said, good morning one time. These were $3.99 from Ray Dunn. I absolutely love those. So I decided that I need a new cereal bowl. Because I got, I mean, we got bowls. So that's not what I mean. But um, there is like one cereal bowl that I use every time I eat cereal. And I absolutely love it. That's why I use it so much. But, um, I just felt like I just need another one, you know? Okay, so we got some lipstick to try on. This is in the color Dolce um, Vita. Vita. It's V-I-T-A. And it's number 1028. I thought it was a pretty color. And this is from NARS, by the way. And it was $7.99. I need to get it out. Turn it all the way around. Make sure nobody touched it. But I thought that was a beautiful, beautiful color. It's kind of like a brownie nude. Nudie brown. I don't know. Let's try it on. Ooh. I, I don't know if this is the same color I got, but I have a NARS, and it is just about down at the nub, and it is a brownish shade like this. Now, I don't know if it's the exact same color, but maybe it will be. Love it. I think that's very pretty. What do you think? I think it'll go with this makeup look that I got on today. Next shade we got was from MAC, and it is $7.99 as well, in the color Love, Lovern, Love Lorn, Love Lorn, shade 511. Let's see. This is like a pink shade. Pinky nude, I think it's gorgeous. We'll try it on too. So, definitely after I bought lipstick, of course I was feeling better after that. I back up to 100% now. Oh, and I had pizza for supper and I was craving that. My Domino's in Seertown, they kept me on hold for five minutes one time. And then, I, I didn't really want to give up trying because I really wanted it on Domino's. And so, I tried a couple more times, but I didn't stay on hold for five minutes. So I wound up getting Papa John's and it was excellent. I love this color. Don't you? What do y'all think about this color? Love it. Um, you know, when you when I go to TJ Maxx, I feel like I can get as good as I feel like I can get the good stuff for less, which is why I like to go to TJ Maxx because I just feel like, you know, like I said, I can get the good for less. So if I want a MAC lipstick versus buying um, Maybelline or some CoverGirl or whatever else I might want from uh, CVS, you know, I feel like I can get the, um, I feel like I can get it at TJ Maxx. However, if there's a CoverGirl lipstick you want, I think you could go get it. Because I'm not knocking CoverGirl. I like it. I like it all. I don't think I really have anything I don't like. This is called Body Prescription Talk to the Hand Citrus Moisturizing Hand Cream. It was $3.99. I don't know. I've seen it and I thought, let's try that. It must have a little layer on it. I'm going to smell of it. I did not open it in the store because, you know, I wasn't going to be like somebody else I've seen. That's just not my way. Oops. I got that on there. You see it? And it came out. But it smells nice. Nice and citrusy. Let's see. I like a lot. 
I feel like if you can put on a little bit, why can't you put on a lot of lotion, you know? Mmm, smells nice. It's thick. I think I'm, it might sound, feel like something you might want to put on before you go to bed, you know? It smells very good. Citrusy. So, anyway, I got that. Oh, I remember last night when I went to... We hadn't got to the gay ball. Never mind. I did buy some... Um, last night... I don't know where it's at right now, but... I did buy some... What am I trying to think? Oh, this nail polish right here. And I like it, but it's not the color I wanted. For some reason in my mind, I wanted some milky gray nail polish. So, I found this tonight at TJ Maxx. It's like a brownish gray. Um, I've never seen this mineral fusion i had never seen this brand before um it's 3.99 i thought i'd try it and see what it was like kind of looks like a milky like a creamy gray which i might try my paint my nails later with that i don't know depends on how long i stay up tonight i guess okay the next thing i got because i love elf makeup products um all their stuff that i've bought from elf has been so good i seen this it was 3.99 and it's called um dewy setting powder and coconut let's just try some i mean everything i've ever bought from elf i absolutely love it so let's spray some and see what it's like And it has that great coconut smell. I feel like you can't go wrong with e.l.f. E.l.f. makeup and products are, you know, they're really easy on your skin. Or they are on mine. And um, they work good and they're affordable. I just I just love e.l.f. Okay, next thing I want to tell you about was I went to Gabe's. Oh, that was what I was telling at the first video. Um, apparently they are a chain store and they have them all over. I don't know, you just have to look it up. I didn't know Cartersville had one until I walked in it last night. And like I said, it was like a TJ Maxx or Ross on steroids. I can't even say that word. And, um, so I mentioned a birthday party crap that I have to attend. I don't have to, but I want to, you know, that I plan to attend on the first and um so i got this cute little outfit right here it's got a little black shirt and it's got these little cute little levi shorts with so i bought this for 14.99 compared to um 36 dollars so i got that i mostly bought snacks there like they had like their one liter cokes and diet cokes for like a dollar i bought that they had pop tarts i bought some of those um just some random things i needed you know and i'm going to florida soon and this hat matches my bathing suit now i got my hair up so you probably won't be able to tell it good but this is my hat don't you love it ain't it cute as a button so while i'm sitting in a chair tanning i don't want to i might not want to get all this all red and stuff so i got this cute little hat to put on or i could wear it like the girls in the movies that's the way they wear their hat but i'm not gonna wear it like that so anyways i got that little oh i bet you want to know how much that was and this is like a turquoise um turquoise is my favorite color it matches everything this was let me tell you this was $7.99, and it's from Milani. That's what it says, and it's got that cute little chain on there. But anyway, I thought it was cute. Let me put my hair back up if you guys don't mind. So, yeah. Tonight I wore this instead of a bun. I'm usually all about bun style, but I decided that I need a little change. Oh, I got one more thing. Duh, it's still right in the paper. Got so distracted by my hat. Now those were from Gay's, but this is from TJ Maxx because I just forgot it. But um, I do want to get me some vitamin C for my face. Vitamin C is supposed to help fine lines and wrinkles, so I wanted to get some of this. It's um, vitamin C plus rose oil facial 
facial, facial, facial serum. Um, Brighton is from Vital Beauty, and it was five ninety nine. Now I have never tried this before, um, but I'm gonna try this, and then you know I might go on to try something else. You can't never tell, but hopefully this will work. I'm sure it will. Um, I've never been a smoker. I've never smoked anything a day in my life. But you know when you suck a straw, you get these, you know these little lines right here. They're not bad. I don't have them real bad, but I don't want to have them. So. I'm going to protect myself with that. And um, this is pretty much, this is my whole haul. I have nothing else to show you. Not in this haul. Um, but I'm going to let you guys go. I'm thinking about eating my dessert, which is crumb cake. Crumb cake. Have y'all ever ate little bites? These are so good. Um, I used to eat the blueberry all the time. And then Mama, one day, she had bought some that were called, like, Sprinkle, Confetti Sprinkle or something. I can't remember what it's called. But, y'all, if y'all like birthday cake the way I like birthday cake, all you need is those, a little pack of those, and some icing, and it will taste just like a cupcake. Now, I had bought icing to go with mine, but I sure am tempted because those little bites with those that sprinkle cake, oh my gosh, it, it's just so good. It tastes just like a cupcake, and it's just fabulous. But um, anyways, I usually um, another random side note. I love this pink. I usually keep my Ray Dunn cups in my room because I just I like them. I like all the sayings and stuff. But I'm thinking about a little display in here. I have some in the kitchen too that I keep in there. And drink my tea in at night when I want some hot tea. But, um, I'm thinking about a little of this radon display in my room. So, I'm going to set that up one day. Hopefully this week. So, if I get that set up, I'll send you a picture. Or, i tell you what, you can find it on Instagram. Um, I'll be posting some pictures on Instagram today that, um, I had taken while I was at TJ Maxx of more Ray Dunn stuff that I had to leave on the shelf, including the Bless Mom cookie jar in blue. It was so pretty. I mean, I guess it don't have to be a cookie jar. It could just be whatever you want it to be. Um... But anyway, so there's that. I guess I'll let you guys go. I love talking to y'all. And thank you so much for stopping by and watching my haul. If you're not subscribed to my channel, I ask you to please subscribe. Share it with your friends. Um, I try to be a blessing to other people. I'll pray for you. All you got to do is ask me to. Tell me. What, you don't even have to tell me what you're praying about because God knows. And if you'll just ask me to pray for you, I will. And whatever I can do to be kind to someone and and help someone, I, I want to actually do that. Um, but yeah, so please subscribe and share. And, and I hope y'all have a wonderful, wonderful night. And I hope you sleep well. I love you all. Good night. Bye.